ABC 13 Plus is back this week, and we're bringing you stories from uh, Richmond and Rosenberg. And reporter Chaz Miller talked with some small business owners who wouldn't dream of setting up roots anywhere else. Chaz? Mel, yeah, you mentioned ABC 13 Plus. I'm so excited it's back this week. We're in Rosenberg this afternoon. The reason I'm excited it's back is because you learn all these cool things about communities you never knew existed. For example, this building behind me is home to a restaurant, a wine bar, a salon, a theatrical company, and an antique shop. On top of that, the oldest operational elevator in the state of Texas is right behind me in that building as well. It was a natural choice for our ABC 13 Plus pop-up newsroom in Rosenberg. That is the 110-year-old Vogelsong building right in downtown Rosenberg. Your wife works in Richmond. Correct. You work in Rosenberg. Yep. Tell me the difference between Richmond and Rosenberg. They're pretty similar. Both um, old towns are right on a railroad. Uh, they both have similar stores, antique shops. You guys both own small businesses in Rosenberg. Why is Rosenberg a good place to do that? So, honestly, when, when we first opened uh, the cafe, the Old Railroad Cafe in Rosenberg, I think one of the reasons that we've been so successful is because of the community here in downtown Rosenberg. Um, you, you can't build a business by yourself, and it was unbelievable what the support was from historic Rosenberg when we opened. That was an advantage during COVID that you had a lot of these different businesses and customers really rally together to take care of each other. We need to be unified as one. We need to be here together as a team, and that's what Old Downtown does. We work together in Rosenberg as a team to support each other. And if I can't, I'm not open the day, I'll send you to over here to get shirts, or I'll send you over to the antique shops, or I'll send you over to another time soda fountain and get a milkshake. That's what we do as a team. You don't live in Rosenberg, you live in Sugarland, but you say you come here almost every day. Almost, because they have so many shops, so many uh, thing entertainment. So Joe, what's your favorite place in Rosenberg and why? I suppose here, uh, because of the variety of foods. And Daisy? Oh, they have so many shops there, my my specialty here. Yeah, a lot of shops here in downtown Rosenberg. They kept talking about community in that piece. I gotta tell you, my favorite member of the community might have been that dog, his name was Turtle. He's at the t-shirt shop right around the corner. I tried to take a selfie with him because I'm a millennial. And when I took that selfie with him, he knocked me to the ground with kisses. So that's my buddy. Richmond and Rosenberg will be here all week long. It's so cool. They really feel like you're in a different time. They're big communal places, lots of local stores, and I'm super excited to show them to you all week long as part of ABC 13 Plus. Live in Rosenberg, I'm Chaz Miller, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.